Hello and welcome to PE Buddy. It's a D here. Today we're going to learn about muscle. Let's do it. The learning intention for this video is to learn about the muscular system. We'll learn to explain the three types of muscle, identify how many muscles there are in the human body, describe what muscles are made of, and finally explain how muscles create movement. So to get us started, there are three types of muscle. Number one, skeletal muscle. Number two, smooth muscle. Number three, cardiac muscle. What do these mean? Skeletal muscle gives you a bit of a hint. Skeleton, skeletal. So that's about the bones and the muscles. So the muscles we can see on the outside the muscles we can contract voluntarily. These are called voluntary muscles. Number two, our smooth muscle. These are the muscles in our digestive system and other organs. They are called involuntary muscles because we can't turn them on and off. We can't control them, which is a good thing. And finally, we have our cardiac muscle. Cardio, cardiac, that gives you a bit of a hint. It's to do with our heart and it's to do with the muscle walls that pump blood all around our body. In today's video, we're only going to focus on skeletal muscle, so let's dive a bit deeper. So how many muscles are there in the human body? Here's just a quick glimpse of a few of the major muscles, but in fact, there are over 600 muscles. But don't worry, we're not going to go through them all today. We might leave that for the next video. Stay tuned for that. So what are muscles made of? So here we can see the journey of muscle starting up here and ending all the way down here into what's called the sarcomeres. So we're going to have a look at this journey to understand what muscles are made of and how they create movement. So first, when we think of muscle, this is what we usually think of. The muscles we can see with our eyes. Specifically, we might think of athletes, bodybuilders, but in fact, everybody has muscle. Some are just bigger than others. So let's zoom in to see exactly what muscles are made of. So here we have another diagram. Here is a bone. This white thing is called a tendon. That joins bones to muscles. If we peeled the skin back, this is what your muscle would look like. It's made of many different parts. Let's zoom in again. We have long bundles called muscle fibers. Hundreds and thousands of these make up your muscle. We zoom even more within that bundle of muscle fiber, we have myofibrils. It's like a bundle in a bundle in a bundle. If we zoom in even further in, we have sarcomeres. As we can see here, it's that little section on the myofibril between what's called a Z-disc and another Z-disc. Finally, within the sarcomeres, we have thick myosin filaments. These are the purple lines here and we have thin actin filaments. These are green in this diagram here. So we've had a look at the structure of muscle, what it's made up of. Now we're gonna dive a little bit deeper to find out how these work together to create movement. So in this animated diagram, we have the thick red myosin filaments and the thin blue actin filaments. The myosin, grab onto the actin, pull using ATP, transferring that to ADP, to create movement. I'll talk about this process of energy in a different video, which you might like to check out in the top corner there. But essentially, this happens within the sarcomere, and there's hundreds of sarcomeres lined up side by side by side by side along the muscle. So as you can imagine, if all of the hundreds of sarcomeres lined up do this exact same process at the same time, pulling the muscle across, this is what creates movement, the shortening or contracting of the muscle. Now this looks visually, and we've got the muscle contracting. If you can imagine all the sarcomeres along here contracting at exactly the same time, that is how the bicep contracts, creates movement. Let's review to see if you've learnt about the muscular system. So our first success criteria, can you explain the three types of muscle? So you'll need your pen and paper for this. Write down one, two, and three. Write down the three types of muscle and then explain which parts of the body they refer to and whether they are voluntary or involuntary. Good 
Here are the answers. We have skeletal, smooth, and cardiac, our three types of muscle. Skeletal is the outside of the visible muscles that we can see that create movement, and they are voluntary. We can control them. Number two, smooth muscle. These are internal. We cannot see them. These are our organs and our digestive system. And these are involuntary, meaning we cannot control them. Third, we have our cardiac muscle. This, as the name suggests, is the muscle of the heart, and again, this is involuntary. Okay, our second success criteria. How many muscles are there in the body? Can you remember? There are over 600 muscles in the body. Okay, our third success criteria. Can you describe what muscles are made of? Again, grab your pencil out, copy this diagram. We are starting on the, the macro scale, the large muscles where we can see, and we're gonna end in the microscopic microfilaments. So what you need to do is fill in the blanks. How did you go? Going from a macro to a micro level, we'll start with the muscles, that goes down into the muscle fibers, let's go down into the myofibrils, down further into the sarcomeres. Within the sarcomeres, we have the two myofilaments, actin and myosin. Our fourth and final success criteria. Can you explain how muscles create movement? With your pen or pencil, copy down these two sentences and fill in the blanks. Use the context and what you've learned in this video See how you go. Okay, so large myosin filaments latch onto and pull on the smaller actin filaments, shortening the sarcomeres. When hundreds of sarcomeres lined up end to end contract, the muscle contracts and creates movement. Congratulations for making it to the end of the video. So how did you go? For a gold medal, you need to get four out of four success criteria 100% correct. For a silver, three out of four, and for a bronze, two out of four. If you didn't quite get 100%, rewatch this video a few times and try again. Thanks for watching, everybody. Make sure you like, comment with any feedback or questions you still have, and subscribe for more videos. Good luck.